talked to uh, Glaber earlier about the uh, the work he's done defensively um, and the fact that he feels better physically. What, what what changes, what improvements have you seen from him at shortstop? Yeah, uh, obviously he came in in really good shape. You know, uh, he worked really hard during the off season, and you know uh, you could see with the way he's moving right now. You know, on, on his pregame work on the backfields and uh, <clears throat> just. You know, I, I go back to last year towards the end, you know, when he developed a really good routine and, and his preparation and he's just carrying over, you know, like the attention to details, you know, just being excellent at making the routine plays, the details, the way he prepares, and, you know, you could see it uh, on, on the early going. So we're very pleased with where he's at right now. We can see the results just in the numbers offensively in the second half of the regular season last year and into the playoffs. Off of what you just said, was that true defensively as well? Was 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 the, the improvement on offense kind of mirrored at shortstop? No doubt about it. You know, uh, obviously after you know he went down and and he rehabbed it, and when he came back, you know he, he you know he was a different different player. He was a you know different mindset. I think there was a trust factor. Uh, he was getting better results, and then he carried over into the postseason. You know, and we were very pleased with the the way he finished the year. So uh, you know we're. We, ex you know, we expect to, to the same results uh, moving forward. Thanks. Take the next one from Brian Hoke. Hey, Mendy. Um, Brian Cashman said that uh, Glaber was not in shape when he came back to summer camp, and it took him a while to get going. Was that uh, something the coaching staff saw too? How did you rate his conditioning last year? Yeah, look, I mean, everybody knows how difficult that, that you know, uh, the year was, uh, especially when we got shut down after spring training, and it was so hard to get ready, you know, and because we didn't know when we were going to get back uh, to start playing games again, you know, and yeah, Brian made his comment, but, you know, to be honest with you, just the communication with Glaber and all that, um, he, he kept saying that, that he felt fine, and, you know, uh, at the end of the day, our job is, you know, to prepare the guy on on, on a daily basis and, 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 and get him ready to play a big league game, so you know, this year he looks really, really good. Obviously, uh, we could see it in the early going, like I said, and, and, and we're very happy with, with where he's at right now. Take the next one from Pete Caldera. Hi, Mendy. Hey, Pete. Hey, uh, how are you doing? Uh, you know, a lot of the winter talk uh, that was surrounding labor had to do with what he lacks as a shortstop. And, and I, I was wondering if if you uh, and the coaching staff have to do some reinforcing with him about what he can do and, and what he's expected to do. Yeah, you know, um, obviously, you know, you're the shortstop of our team, you know, and, and, and you expect, to, you expect to, to, to go out there and, and, and make routine plays. But just staying positive with him, you know. Uh, obviously, he's going to make errors, you know, but just, just try and stay positive, you know. Take a look at the positive notes, you know, and, and, and making sure that he's still aggressive when he's playing on the field, you know. Like, we don't want him to be shy on the field. He's just got to continue to be aggressive, being wanting to have that ball and, and be able to turn the switch to the next play because that's what's the most important. So as a coaching staff, that's, that's our job to make sure that he's positive and, you know, we continue to reinforce that, you know, uh, those positive advice. Thank you. Next one to Brendan Cuddy. Hey, Mindy. Thank you for taking the time. Good to see you. Good to see you. Uh, is there a particular place you think you'll see or fans will see the improvements in Glaber's game in, you know, his range, uh, his throwing arm, or, you know, uh, anything in particular where you think that you guys focused? Yeah, I think uh, 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 a little bit of everything, you know, uh, his overall play, you know, the consistency, like I said, you know, that's that's something that – uh, we expect, you know, from him, you know, balls hit to the shortstop and just convert convert the play, you know, uh, whether it's, you know, range plays or, you know, being a leader on the on the infield, you know, communicating with others, positioning and all that. But uh, at the end of the day, it comes down to being excellent at the little details, you know, and, and, and that's what we're looking for. And he made it a point to mention that he lost some weight this offseason. It's one thing to come in last year potentially out of shape, but also to lose weight in the off season. How do you think that that weight loss may help? I mean, he looks great right now. He looks great and, and, and you know, the goal is for him to maintain that that, that, that condition and 
at the end of the day, I, I think it's, you know, we'll see the results. So, uh, like I say, we're really happy with, with where he's at right now. Thank you. Next one to Sweeney Murdy.